Hi, right, so this is Casey's Crazy Ideas. Welcome back. Uh, this is a quick video for our pellet stove. Uh, we did modify it. We had the problem we were running into. It was after, during the really cold temperatures, after about 12 hours, it was running dry. We're pretty close, and you know, we're having a hard time with our jobs to keep it full from time to time. So we decided to change it up a little bit and add an additional hopper that holds probably 25 additional pounds and that gets us through uh, obviously it defeats some of the features on it a little bit but you know, I'd rather the house stay warm than you know come home and the house is cold I mean yeah we do have a furnace but you know we're trying to keep it off because the prices of propane are horrendous but it's been doing a good job. As you can see down in there. And we got probably three quarters of the normal hopper left. Um, is not too much to show. As you can see in there. Got a little bit of water up here to try and add a little bit of moisture to the area. Whether or not it's working, I don't know. But, uh, that's about it. You know, it's been a great thing to have. Keeps the house 72 degrees around the clock. Clean it out every two to three days. You know, it's typical maintenance. We use hardwood pellets, 40 pound bags, nothing fancy. You know, we don't. We try to keep the harder stuff with the burns better. But uh, like I said, it's a short video. You know, it was a, about $25, $2,700 or so to install. We did make the floor thing ourselves. It's not finished, but, you know, it's just trim. Not too concerned. But, uh, that's about it. Thanks for watching.